We are under the lights this evening as we get you set for another edition of Baseball on the Show. Tonight, an intriguing matchup between the Houston Astros and the Arizona Diamondbacks. And here's the left-handed hitting Michael Brantley. And we are set for baseball here this evening. The 1-1. One, one. Takes a pass and misses. That's strike two. One and two. And a good pitch there as this is swung on and missed for the first out of the ball game. At the plate, the Alex Bregman. Alex hit in the air to center field center fielder giving chase but he can't get there it's over his head around second he's on his way to third and he's safe that is third the second baseman Jose Altuve into the box now Jose Altuve oh and there's a drive to deep left center you can pretty much forget about this one this is way out of here at the plate now Jordan Alvarez oh they have him looking awfully confused up there right now it's one and two guess where he's going with this next pitch Probably a little further outside. See if the fish are still biting. Throw gets him two down. So here's Yuli Gurriel. He's coming off a three hit ball game in Sunday's series finale. Gurriel. From the windup, the 1 1 pitch. Sent on the ground, but right into the shift. Throw on to first, gets him, and the side is retired. Stepping up now, Starling Marte. He'll lead things off here in the bottom half of the first. Into the corner and slicing foul. Now another 1-2. And the knuckle curved that time. Got him swinging, and that's the first out. So the bases are empty with one man gone. And that means that Nick Ahmed will be the next to bat. Now one hit foul over to the right side as the count moves to one and two. Looking for back-to-back -back K's to start the game. Hit in the air down the right field line. But this will land untouched. He was looking for a swing and a miss breaker right there, but left that one in the zone that got fouled off. And he'll lay off the curveball that's in the dirt that time, and it's back to even now at two and two. And there's a fastball well off the plate inside. That's a great pitch for a spot like that. It looks like a strike that it just comes in out of the zone. You can command that with movement. It's a very effective pitch to pitching hitters inside. Batting third. At the plate, Patel Marte. And two and two. I like what he was trying to do there with the two seam fastball, but that's a tough pitch to come in. When you throw it glove side like that, it's really tough to get it to come back to the corner. He's set. Here's the two two. And he fouls this one off. Swing and a miss. Looked like the knuckle curve there, and that's out number two. Into the box now, David Peralta. He takes his first cuts in this one with a man at first and two away. The two and one on its way. Mitch misses low. The throw down. It skips in, and he's safe. Close play, but he's in there. Ready with the 3-1. Here's a fly ball well hit left fielder giving chase he's there to track it down and that'll end the inning George Springer the next to hit 
one of the keys to securing a win. They want to keep the pressure on and try to build that lead as much as they can moving into the later innings. Fouled off. Once again, a 3-2. High fly ball out to straightaway center. Marte is there, and he has it for the first out. So the base is empty here with one away. And ambling over to the batter's box is Carlos Correa. Hits this one hard the other way. And a backhanded reach at first, but he can't flag it down. Batting it. The catcher. Garrett Stubbs. So now to the plate. Garrett Stubbs on the ground to the right side. And that gets through for a one-out base hit. And that runner will go no further than second as there are two aboard that now. The pitcher, number 23, Lance to the plate now, Lance McCullers. And he pops up the bunt attempt. Only plays to first, so the pitcher does his job as it's a successful sacrifice. So two on with two away, and Michael Brantley settles in to hit at the plate. Michael Brantley. One and two now. Even though it's early on in this one, anytime you get runners in scoring position, you'd like to knock them in. Now a curveball knocked down at home plate. And a nice job to keep the runners at bay as the count moves to two and two. Here's the two and two. And there's a line drive. Base hit to left field. And not in time as the run scores. Throw won't get him. The third base hit, number two. Alex Bregman. Into the box, Alex Bregman. Line drive to center field. And that's in there. Base hit. Now batting. The second base hit. Jose. Stepping in now. Jose Altuve. Two balls and a strike to Jose Altuve. It's fouled away. Brentley over at second. Bregman on at first with two down. And another foul ball. Another 2 2 offering. Lifted in the air to center. Marte is going to have room out there as he puts this away to retire the side. Eduardo Escobar standing in. Past meetings against Lance McCullers. He's 0 for 7. The 3 and 1 pitch. Finds the zone to fill the count. 3 and 2. Oh, and this ball is absolutely blasted. High and deep. See you later. Over the wall, a home run. Into the box now, Christian Walker. Now a foul tip that's held onto with the plate, and the count moves to one and two now. He is in complete command out on the mound today. He's got all four corners locked in, and now he's raising eye levels to boot. Got him to miss the breaking ball there. Christian Walker is dealt with for the first out in the bottom of the inning. Hit back up the middle. Scooped up. Throw on to first, two gone. Stepping in, Ildemaro Vargas, the as the switch hitter will take his cuts left-handed here. Yeah, he's not quite as powerful from the left side. He's certainly not Chipper Jones, who has pop from both sides of the plate. Much more pop hitting right-handed. The count now at 2-1. and one. And they set up away with the fastball, but it misses 3-1. and one. One thing that could nag at you as a pitcher is having to work really hard to get a guy that you think you should be able to cruise right through. And the throw to first is there. The inning is over.
Now batting, Jordan Alvarez. 0 for 1 here in the early going. Yanked high and deep down the line in right. And it's a foul ball. Had to sit back on the changeup, and he did a good job to get the bat on that one. Here's another one, too. Fastball swung on and missed for the first down. One out now in the Houston third. The and digging in to bat ten. next, the Cuban import, oh, yeah. Yuli Gurriel. Gurriel. Now a swing and a deep drive to left. And it ain't coming back. And gone. An absolute bomb. In now, George Springer. Swing and a miss on the changeup, and there are two gone. Digging in, Carlos Correa. He singled his last time up. Stop. Carlos Correa. Now a swing and a fly ball. And it's a foul ball. The one two. Well hit the other way, and it's into the gap. He's through first and hustling for second. And now he'll get into scoring position with two away. Now that Garrett At the plate now, Garrett Stubbs. This one's flared toward left center. And no one can corral that one. Base hit. And that'll plate run number six. It's now a six to one ball game. To the plate now, Lance McCullers. A ball and two strikes to the Astros pitcher. These guys hitting aren't in first place by accident. They excel at getting out to early lead, so this is a big moment in this game. If they're able to lengthen this lead any more in this inning, they're going to be in really good shape to come away with a win today. He'll try again, one, two. And a half-hearted swing there as they tie him up inside for the third strike, and the inning is over. Next to hit will be the pitcher, Luke Weaver. Lots of baseball left in this one as we're still early on, but you don't want to fall too far behind. They're already down by a bundle, and one of the things you want your leadoff guy to get on and set the table for the big boys to start driving in some runs. Now a swing and a miss as he picks up another one. Make it four strikeouts already, and there's your first the out. Fielder, number two. Now at the plate, Go Starling Marte. He looked to bounce back Marte. after striking out his last time up. 1-1 one, one pitch is a knuckle curve. He's in the hole now, 1-2. and two. Whoa, right back at him, and it hit him. And they'll have no play as he reaches first base safely. Here's a look over to first. Runner back safely. Into the box, Nick Ahmed. Pitch out, nothing doing. Fouled away. Runner at first here, one man out. He's running. Swing and a miss, strike three. The throw is going to be far too late. That's a stolen base. Man at second here with two away. And that'll bring up the infielder, Cattell Marte. On a line, that's a base hit. Long throw to the plate. Oh, but it's offline, so the run will score. The battle. No the Stepping in now, David Peralta. This is line to left. Alvarez has it, and the inning is over.
back to the top of the order now. And that brings in the left-handed hitting outfielder, Michael Brantley. Now the one-and-one one pitch. Waves and misses for strike number two. And they'll try to get him fishing there, but he won't offer in the dirt, and it's back to even at two and two. Lots of hits given up, but so far, no walks. At least he's making them work to get on base. Problem is, they haven't had to work too hard. Lifted the other way to left center. Around first, he's digging for second. And this will kick off the base of the wall. And he is in there. Mike Leak answers the call the from the pen here in the fourth as they didn't get the outing they were hoping for from the starter. Now for the Number eight. Standing in now, Alex Bregman. Change up. Good pitch there. One and two. That's the exact spot to lean on as a reliever. As a hitter, you just have to tip your cap and look for the next one. And a change up swung on and missed for the first down. So a definite RBI spot here. Runner at third, one away. And that'll bring in Jose Altuve. Hit out towards second. Fielded cleanly. Throw from shallow right will get him at first, but the run will come in to score. Ready for another shot now, Jordan Alvarez. He's 0 for 2 with a strikeout in this one. Checks his swing here, but he does so in time. Leak is a reliever known for forcing contact. Not a huge strikeout guy most of the time, but he also doesn't issue a lot of free passes either. There's a couple of keys to being a good reliever. One, if you have great stuff and you strike everybody out, or like this guy, not afraid to throw the ball in the strike zone. He has good stuff, not great stuff. He's not afraid to let his defense help him out and make some plays. Swing and a ball line down in the left field corner. But this will be foul. He's set. Here's the 2 2. A bouncer to the left side. Throw to first in plenty of time, and the side is retired. Digging in, Eduardo Escobar. He got a hold of one and went yard in his first appearance in this one. Yeah, Matt, and going back to that last at bat when he hit the homer, that was a fastball. That... There's a swing and a ball hit in the air and a ball that he got every stitch of as that one, without a doubt, is gone. Into the box now, Christian Walker. A ball and two strikes now. And the knuckle curved that time. Got him swinging, and that's the first out. Digging in for his second at bat, Stephen Vogt. He's 0 for 1 after grounding out in his only trip to the plate so far. Down low, two balls and a strike. We got two balls, one strike. Too high that time, and it's three and one. If I'm in the box right now, I'm coming unglued. He is going to throw something over the heart of the plate. And it's up to a three two full count now. Yanked high and deep down the line in right. And it's a foul ball. Bouncer to the left side. Bregman gloves it. Throw on to first will get him. Score it 5-3 on the putout, though it looked more like a 6-3 ground ball. Nevertheless, there are two away now. Now at the plate, Ildemaro Vargas. He got on top of one and was a ground out victim last time. And here's a pitch swung on and missed. One and two now. A nice job of bouncing back after the leadoff homer. Two quick outs. After. Threw it right past him. A swing and a miss at the gas, and that ends the inning. All ready to go in the top of the fifth. Now to the plate, George Springer. He's hitless in his two at-bats so far. One and two now as that one's fouled off.
fly ball out to right field. Marte's after it. He makes the catch. A great effort to get there and record the first down of the inning. Coming to the plate now, Carlos Correa. Already two for two. He'll look to add on right here. And he fouls this one off. Smoke toward third. He's got it. And there are two away now. Digging now in now, Garrett Stubbs. He Garrett. came through with an RBI Stubbs. single in his last at bat. Hit on the ground to short. Ahmed has it. Throw not in time, and he beats it out for his third hit tonight. Now batting. The pitcher, Lance. At the plate now, Lance McCullers. I got to count one Looked like he was on that one, but it's one and two. Trying to go the other way. This is looped out toward third. But little trouble handling this one down there at third as that will end the inning. Domingo Leyva will get the call here as he'll hit for the pitcher. Pinch hitting for the diamond die. Number one. Domingo Leyva. And he just misses inside with the fastball there. To third. Oh, and he can't come up with it. And that's the first out. Digging in next will be Starling Marte. A hit in two at bats for him at this point in the ballgame. The 1 1 home. This is on the ground over to first. And he'll step on first himself for the out. Now at the plate, Nick Ahmed, who was sat down on strikes in his last at bat. Bases are empty here with two men out. Count is one and two now. Two out lightning definitely applies to this offense. If this two hole hitter can get on, they could start something serious. And he struck him out, his eighth punch out of the ball game, and that one ends the inning. Merrill no, Kelly you, takes over to start the now, sixth pitcher, inning on the mound. Number 29, Merrill. Top half of the Kelly. sixth about to get started. In now, Michael Brantley. So far, two for three in this one. Change up just off the black, and it's two and one. Line drive, base hit. So now to the plate, Alex Bregman. And he lays off again, ball three. There's a drive high in the air and deep to left center field. And he's going to make the catch on the warning track. A fine running play there for the first out. So up to the plate next will be now Jose Matt, Altuve. He was retired via the ground ball last time up. Yeah, Matty, expect this pitcher to try and get the same result. That's his last at bat right here. The double play is in order. Anything on the ground, the way this defense is, they could certainly roll too. The left fielder, number 44, Jordan Alvarez. To the plate now, Jordan Alvarez. That misses, and we're even at two and two. Never tempted to swing at that ball down low. It's ball three. I don't think he can afford another base runner here, so whatever pitch he feels best about, whichever one he feels most comfortable with, that's the one I expect him to turn to. Marte is over to his right as he puts this one away. Two down. Digging in once again, Yuli Gurriel. He was a ground out victim last time up. A 1 1. 
Back up the middle and in for a base hit. They're going to extend their lead as the runner scores from second. It's an eight to three ball game. The center fielder, number four, George Springer. Into the box, George Springer. This one's down to third. Throw on to second for the force, and the side is retired. Bottom of the inning now, so striding in, Cattel Marte. He's working on a one for two game so far. This one doesn't look good so far. Down by a boatload as we enter the middle innings. It's about time they get something going. And the last thing you want to do is fall behind where you have to score a bunch in the eighth and ninth inning. So now it'll be the four hole hitter, David Peralta. He's 0 for 2 in the ballgame so far. The 3 1. Three runs, five hits. No errors so far for the Diamondbacks. And a fastball swung on and hit to second. And an off-balance throw is in time as he takes one away. Wow. Now Trying to pick things up where he left off. Eduardo Escobar. Two home Escobar. runs already to his name in this one. And we'll see if he could possibly strike again. Yeah, man, this guy flexed his muscles in that last at bat. We heard that he has good power. That last bomb had to go well over 400 feet. He hit it a long way. And he hits the corner with that one, two and two. Just hung in there on that one. Yeah, you could tell he was ready for another fastball, but the pitcher went to breaking ball, and the hitter just fouls that one off. Pulled toward right center field. Springer has a read on it. No trouble with this one, and the inning is over. Carlos Correa now two for three with a double on his line so far the one one high and deep to left this one's got plenty of distance and it's gone as they add still another Stepping in now, Garrett Stubbs. Called strike, and he's behind one and two. Two strikes. A two and two count to the Astros catcher. Here now the two-two. Hit on the ground down the first baseline, but a foul ball as it holds it two and two. Bounce to first. Scooped up. And he'll flip it to the pitcher covering for the out. Next up for the Strohs, Lance McCullers. One run in and one gone so far in this inning. Two and one. You certainly know he's not trying to work around the pitcher. But sometimes the hardest thing to do is to throw a strike to a guy that you know won't swing the bat. And this one is over, and he works the count back to two and two. Lifted down the line and left. Peralta on the move. And they can't run it down. Here's another 2-2. Two -two. Grounded to short. Ahmed fields it cleanly. And the throw pulls the first baseman off the bag, and he's safe at first. Now batting. Standing in, Michael Brantley. One in, one out, and one on here in the inning. Not much behind this as this ball is looped over toward first. A leap, but he can't bring it down. Base hit. And it's not in time as he's in well ahead of the throw. Corbin Martin enters now in a mop-up roll as he'll try to keep the deficit right where it is. In now, Alex Bregman. Here's a swing and a ground ball, but this will get foul. It's a ball and two strikes. The one two. Back up the middle. There is Ahmed. The second for one on the first. And talk about doing the job out of bullpen. One batter, two outs, and the inning is over. 
Rogelio Armenteros gets the call now from the pen four, to take two, over on the mound and start the home ball. seventh. Rogelio into the box. Christian Walker. No hits in two trips to the plate for him in the ballgame. It doesn't look very promising so far in this one as we move into the later innings. Down by a bundle, it's time to get some base runners and hopefully a long ball to get them back into this one. Armenteros, a Cuban-born ball player. This is his second year as a major leaguer. Two and two. Fouled off. The 2-2 two -two one more time. Is swung on and missed. He got him. Settling in now. Stephen Vogt. 0 for 2 on his line thus far. Just got the corner that time with a fastball. Strike two. And he strikes him out as well. So make it back to back punch outs here to the first two men he faces out of the bullpen. Three runs, five hits, and one error in the ballgame for Arizona. Now a fastball inside, and he works it back to a full count now. Hit hard, but foul toward first, so he'll come back and line it up again. The next 3 2. Sent in the air out to straightaway central. And he will get there to make the running play, and that will end the inning. Here's the second baseman, Jose Altuve. Two hits in four attempts to this point. Now the one and one pitch. Hit weakly back to the mound. Throw on to first in time, so the leadoff man is set down to open up inning number eight. So here's the cleanup hitter, Jorgan Alvarez. He flew out in his last at bat. Almost, Matty. Almost went deep his last AB. Certainly just missed it. With this guy's big power, he's feeling pretty good at the dish. Look for him to try and get on something and drive it out of the yard this AB. And they'll try to get him fishing there, but he won't offer in the dirt, and it's back to even at two and two. Now a swing and a deep drive to right. And out of here. And I mean by plenty. That ball was crushed. Standing in now, Yuli Gurriel. And this pitch is swung on and missed. And the AL's leading hitter is set down on strikes. Two away. George. Here's George Springer, 0 for 4 with a strikeout thus far. Skied into straightaway right. And he'll get over to me. Oh, it kicks off his glove. How did he do that? Ready for another chance? Carlos Correa, runner in scoring position with two gone. Runner in scoring position at second with two down. Hit hard up the middle. And that's through into center field. Base hit. And this will not be close, and the run will score easily. Now back. Captain Garrett Stubbs. At the plate, Garrett Stubbs. And he takes ball two, and it's two and one. A little early, and now it's even at two and two. Fastball just missed above the zone. For the guy in the mound, this is one of those innings where nothing comes easy. He's thrown a bunch of pitches, and this A.B. hasn't been any different. Definitely laboring at the moment. And a close play at the bag, but a good stretch by the first baseman got the out, and the inning is over. Tim LaCastro will try and get his club back into it here as he'll pinch it to lead off the home half of the eighth. Off 
on the ground to third. And that'll be a base hit, so it's a pinch hit single here to get him started in the home half of inning number eight. The right fielder, number two, Starling. So now to the plate, Starling Marte. And this ball runs away for ball two, two and one. Fly ball out to straightaway right. Brantley is under it, looks it into his glove, and there's one gone. Ready now for the Diamondbacks. Now Nick Ahmed. Ahmed. He went down on strikes last Nick. time up. Sometimes you just oh, got to tip your cap to the guy on the mound. He's getting paid to try and get you out as well. Anytime it gets up there north of seven, eight pitch ABs, sometimes it just comes down to pure execution. Let's see if he makes the adjustment right here. And he takes ball three, so it's a full count now. And he struck out again. That's the third time he's gone down on strikes in this one. Up now next for Arizona, Cattell Marte. He's working on a one for three thus far. And it's fouled away. A runner on first with two away. Lifted down the line in left. Bregman in foul ground. And they can't run it down. He got a mistake right there, but missed it. Can't foul that pitch off in a big spot. 0-2 count. Heater caught too much of the zone. The count now at 2-2. Two and two. Lined into right, a base hit. And that runner will go no further than second as there are two aboard now. The batter, Noah Fielder. To the plate now, David Peralta. That's lifted the other way out to left. Alvarez has it, and the inning is over. Stefan Crichton comes on to pitch now, hoping for better results than the other arms that they've run out there in this one. So here right now is the pitcher, Rogelio Armenteros, and he might actually get a chance to hit here. The 1-1. One, one. And a swing and a miss. Good pitch there for the first out here in the ninth. Here's Michael Brantley. He's looking for hit number five in this one right here. The ball and a strike. Here's the pitch. Hard hit ball to short. Throw gets him. Two down. Stepping into the box, Alex Bregman. He was a double play victim last time around. He doesn't have to worry about that in this situation, Maddie. No one on base right now. Try and get something up so you can drive the baseball. Can't keep the weight back, and he falls behind one and two. And the pitch. And a fastball in the dirt that's taken for a ball. You know, something to keep in mind, they're really burning through that bullpen, and this is only the first game of the series definitely could have an impact on the rest of the series and maybe even the whole week ahead. And he turns this one around high and deep to center field. Just missed a home run to the deepest part of the yard. It's off the wall. And he is in the second with a double, his third hit of the night. Now that second baseman, Jose Altuve. Into the box, Jose Altuve. And that misses two and one. And that misses up and in three and one. Jordan Alvarez would be next. And that misses ball four. So it's first and second now with two out. 
Digging in and looking for more, Jordan Alvarez. He's coming off a solo homer in his previous trip. And that last at bat when he went deep, he turned around a pretty good fastball. So I'm kind of thinking this guy's a good fastball hitter. So I might want to move that ball up and down and in and out and try not to throw it right down the middle of the plate. He pulls this one into right. A dive and oh, he can't hang on. He pulls into second safely as also on the play a run comes across to score. Into the box now Yuli Gurriel off speed pitch in the dirt as he takes it for a ball. And there's strike three so we'll see now if they can manage to hold on to this huge lead as the side is retired. Ready to go for the last half of the inning. So here's Eduardo Escobar. He's two for three and looking for more here. Here now the 2 2. Lined hard toward right center. That's in for a base hit. He's now three for four. The batter, the first baseman. Stepping in now, Christian Walker. Late swing, but he's still able to get a lot of this one out toward deep right field. And, oh, he missed a home run by a matter of feet. It's off the wall. And they've really got something going here. Runners at second and third to start the inning. Framber Valdez has given the ball here to try to work out of a tough situation. Two runners in scoring position to deal with. Standing in now, Stephen Vogt. A two ball, two strike count to the Diamondbacks catcher. Fastball got him looking as that had two seam action on it, one gone. The batter number Stepping 15, in, Hildemaro Vargas. Baseman. It was a fly out for him in his last trip. Yeah, and I'm sure he'd like a base hit of some sort right here, Matty. But hey, you know what? Another fly out wouldn't be all that bad. If he can get it deep enough, he should be able to drive in a nice run with a sack fly. Fouled away. The one two. Good take right there. He's given him a great battle with guys in scoring position. We'll see who's going to win this duel. Okay. And he lays off a pitch off the plate and high. Three and two. Pulls this one in the air out to left. Left fielder is on the move. He makes the catch. Here comes the runner from third. They'll cash in here as the run is in to score from third. Carson Kelly will look to provide a little two-out thunder off the bench as he'll hit with a runner at second and two away. Kelly. And this pitch is hit foul off to the left and out of play. So the count goes to two and two now. Arizona down to its last strike. Skied into straightaway right. And he'll put this one away for the final out. And the Astros will add one more to their winning streak as this ball game is over. Well, I'm kind of running out of words to describe how incredible this winning streak has become. Every win just cements their legendary status, and it's not even over yet. 12 to 4 is the final in this game. Houston jumped out to an early lead in the first and never looked back. Lance McCullers earns win number four on the season. Luke Weaver allowed seven earned runs to cross the plate in the losing effort. So that just about does it for Mark DeRosa, Dan Plezak, Heidi Watney, and our entire crew. I'm Matt Vaskersian. You've been watching MLB The Show. For more, make your way over to theshownation.com. Time of the ball game, four hours and 29 minutes. Thank you for joining us here this evening. We remind you to please drive home safely.